Let's get started, baby. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's your scientist, and today I am back with easily the most requested science experiment on my channel and the most trending one on all of YouTube, and that is the 1000 degree glowing knife verse experiment. Today we're going to be taking it up a notch and combining today's most popular trend on YouTube with YouTube's old most popular trend, the 100 layers challenge. So we're going to be cutting through 100 layers of different material to see how the glowing knife stands up to such a massive amount of one thing. We are going to be cutting through 100 layers of styrofoam plates, 100 layers of red plastic cups, 100 layers of duct tape, 100 layers of bubble wrap, and last but not least, 100 layers of chips. You want? I mean, now it's not 100 layers. I didn't ruin the whole fucking video, Bongo. <laughs> First time as into assistant and you're already fucking things up. Jack! John, where'd you go, man? He's out of there. You're lucky. You better not fuck up again, okay? Also, if you're wondering, Jad's not around today, so it's the assistant is Bongo. Bongo, where, where's your- I love that. Where's your fucking lab coat, man? Bro. You... Bro, put that shit on. What are they saying about getting me an extra large, bro? This- Alright, we're good, we're good. You're good? Okay. Yeah. Without any further ado, guys, let's get started. Oh, where are my goggles? All right, we got the gogs, and we've got our welder gloves. As you guys know, if you're doing anything crazy like this, Safety is number one priority. So let's get started. All right, let's get started. We're cooking. Jesus Christ. All right, I think we're ready to go. All right, we're gonna start off small. We're just gonna do a few of the styrofoam plates and see what happens, all right? Easy. Bro. That Easy. feels so cool. I'm chopping Easy. it into a quick pie off. Yo, run me a slice up. Uh, you want a slice? Yeah. Right, here you go, bro. Yo. Oh, fuck, yo. Pop a window, bro. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, yeah. Look at oh, that. Bro, why is it moving after the fact? That's, That's so crazy, weird. bro. All right, we're doing attempt number two with 100 layers of styrofoam plates. It's a little bit easier when you have. Bro, the knife is on fire. Oh, no, it's not. Okay, guys, let's do this. 100 layers of styrofoam paper. Hi, you Let's try another, let's try another. Oh, I'm getting resistance. I'm getting resistance. Can we make it? We made it. Yay. Oh, there we go. <coughs> Don't breathe this. There we go, boys. A clean slice of styrofoam pie. <coughs> Bro. This is rock solid now. Rock solid. Oh, another slice of pie? Yeah. You hungry? No. Stop, stop. <laughs> bro, bro. <laughs> Two clean slices of styrofoam plates, 100 layers of styrofoam plates. This is all like stuck together now too because when it, when it goes through, it kind of melts everything together. Okay guys, I'm ready for the second 100 layers item. I think we're gonna go for uh, bubble wrap. Bubble wrap alert! All right, guys, moving on to 100 layers of bubble wrap. Let's light this bitch up again. <laughs> From this angle, it literally looks like the knife is catching on fire. <laughs> Bro, whoa, whoa, what? No, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. The knife is on fire! <laughs> it's the styrofoam. Oh, okay. Guys, do not try this at home. Oh, do like you're not. trying it at home? Uh, <laughs> Yeah, but I'm a professional scientist. True. And I have my professional assistant. Choke us in! <laughs> Alright, I think that's good. Okay, guys, let's go! Three, two, one! Ayo! Bro, oh shit! Oh my god, it's on, it's on fire! It's on fire! It's on fire! It's on fire! It's on fire. It's on fire. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> let's try, let's this, try this way. Yeah. All right, should we light it back yeah, up? Yeah, All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna get it back up. We're gonna go this way so that we avoid the plastic and paper on this side, and uh, hopefully don't start a fire. Ready? Yeah. All right, 
Let's do this. Bro, clean! <laughs> clean! Look at that! Ayo! No! No! Lady again! Oh! Alright guys, so we put out the fire, but as you can see, the bubble wrap got chopped through cleanly. Even when you put it on the side, it just like melts right through it. Definitely don't recommend using this because it will start a fire. As will possibly the next things we're doing, which is 100 layers of red plastic cups. Bongo, light it up. Lego! We're also switching knives because the other knife is covered in plastic. No, 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 no. Okay. I'm just gonna move this. <coughs> Alright guys, so unfortunately we have met our first match. The 100 layers of plastic cups, we were unable to cut even halfway through all of the cups. We got through the first full cup and probably 20, 30 cups that got actually affected by the cut. So you can see all the different layers of the cups inside there. So it didn't work as well as we were hoping, but it did obviously get through it a lot more easily than just a regular knife would. With that being said, we are moving on to what I think is going to be the most difficult cut and probably the most likely to cause a fire. That is duct tape. Bro, the duct tape is deep. <laughs> it's so deep. Oh. Oh. <sighs> that. <coughs> Turn the fan on. Okay, so now that we've cleaned out the fumes from the room, let's take a look at our duct tape. Come on over here. As you can see, it kind of bubbled up on the sides. It's hard now. And we still only got about a quarter of the way through the duct tape. This shit was deezed. I was pressing as hard as I possibly could, and that is as far as we could get. I tried cutting it earlier with just a regular knife that wasn't heated up, and look, you can barely get through it at all. So it's still significantly better when you have a hot knife, but I think you'd have to heat up the knife four or five times in order to try and get all the way through this piece of duct tape. And you'd probably poison your lungs in the meantime, so we're not gonna do that today. Moving on though, we are gonna go to our final experiment of the day, and that is Pringles, aka 100 layers of chips. Okay. <laughs> Goddamn! Alrighty, let's do this. 100 layers of chips. Ayo! Oh shit. Ayo! Ayo! Are we gonna get to the bottom? Oh! Oh! Yeah! Ah! Ah! That's it. Shout out to the burnt chip. So we caused a little fire. Take a look inside. As you can see, all the chips are burnt, like actually crispy inside. And then on the outside, we got almost all the way to the bottom. See if I can just pop this open, see what happens. Look at the chips, man. That's nuts. The chips were cleanly chopped in half and just melt it on the insides. That's actually so sick. Bongo, I dare you to eat a chip. Taste test? Yeah. Oh, Taste geez. test charred Pringles. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's like eight of them together. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Bro, it was hot. It was still it was hot. hot. No. All right, guys. I think that was one of the craziest science experiments we've ever done with Itzy scientists. So if you guys enjoyed it, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. I gotta give a huge shout out to my boys Bongo and DJ for helping me film and putting their lives at risk for today's video. If you're not already, be sure to subscribe to both of them. I'll leave their links down below in the description. If you guys want to see another edition of the 1,000 Degree Knife. Be sure to let me know by smashing that thumbs up button. If we could get over three likes on this video, I'll be sure to do another one. As always, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will catch you next time. Toodles!